Hello everyone and welcome back to another round of our life family here in Life is a Game where we've got all these little babies running around and I have some great news. I have been very, very carefully hoarding all of our gemstones and we actually have enough to get the final job, you guys. We are at 131 gemstones, which means that we can unlock the final of the jobs that we have available to us, the worker job. Not quite as fun as the streamer career or the doctor career or the police or the firefighter. However, it does mean that we'll be able to go ahead and we'll be able to have some fun as a construction worker if that's what one of our children wants to become. So I'm very excited to go ahead. We're gonna do it. Ugh, okay, uh, it's always so hard to go ahead and spend all my gemstones on that, but we did it and now all of the jobs are unlocked. There's a whole bunch of things that you can unlock to increase the odds that you'll have successful random event chances, but we'll work on upgrading those in the future because what I want to do with the leftover 31 gemstones is actually go ahead and give one of our babies some musical talent because we have not yet had any luck with having a musician or a streamer in our family yet. And we are now up to the 13th generation whoever is going to end up inheriting this next generation and i'm going to try to start adding names to all of the children they probably should have names by now but i'm going to start adding names whoever's going to inherit this next generation might have a chance to become a streamer a construction worker a police officer like a normal office worker uh, a firefighter we unlocked a whole bunch of different careers so i want them to have a great shot but a musician would be really cool too so we're gonna go ahead and even his cries were monstrous more music coins appear boom so now all my butts we just unlocked all of the, uh, like a whole bunch of babies. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we finally unlocked that, which is really fun. And one of the things I realized when we also have our pets, by the way, which we have been unlocking, is that if we wanted to play with our cat, I had to turn the cat on. So you can turn them on or off. And so I'm going to turn on the Russian blue with a charming a smooth coat. Compensation for reduced happiness, 6%. Purr, I've been waiting for you. Aww. So we're going to have a cat this time. We're going to have the 13th generation baby and we're going to go ahead and see what life is going to be like with this next game. All right, roll the dice. It's a girl. Okay, so 13th baby is going to be a girl. What her life is going to be like, I have no idea, but she has a chance to be a musician now. Oh, she wants to be a little cop, just like her father and her grandfather. Because Generation 11 was our first female cop, our first cop ever. Unfortunately, she had a terrible time and was bullied in the force. So she decided to retire when it was time to have some kids. And then her son really wanted to become a cop too. <gasps> Kitty! Oh my gosh! How exciting! Her son really wanted to become a cop too. Oh, and let's go ahead and play with this. Get some happiness going. Can we get any smarts? I think we missed... Yeah, we just missed out on the smarts, but we got a cat, which makes me happy. Um, let's make this girl into music. Like, maybe she's into guitar. Maybe she's into other kinds of things. Alright, let's go with music this time. Maybe music and art? Alright. And we'll hang out with everybody who seems interested in books. And at first she wanted to be a cop, but like, now I'm not sure. Okay, come on, music, music, music. Dang it, I missed out on some of the music. Okay. At this rate, she's just going to become a normal office worker because we don't have enough things. She needs to take her studies a little bit more seriously here towards the end. All right, she got a lot of friends. No, she didn't take her studies seriously enough. We unlocked job market. Okay, I have no idea what that's going to entail, but that's okay. She's trying to keep up a pretty healthy lifestyle. She did end up just in like your typical job market. She's still kind of into music. She's not doing too bad. Uh oh, never mind. <laughs> She's doing bad now. All right, but she's doing pretty good. She's trying to, oops, well, she was trying to keep her health up. Unfortunately, we indulged a little when we shouldn't have. Oh, a kitty. And she likes cats, so there's that. She's gonna have a simpler life, I think, especially because she has like no money. And then let's see if she can bond with some of her friends. 
while we look for somebody to marry. She She's going to tell her kids, look, if you want to be something in school, you've got to take things a little bit more seriously. What about this guy? He seems kind of nice. Yay! All right. But it, and she met him early in life, which means we might have a higher chance of getting more of these family things going. Maybe she'll stay at home. Because, you know, she's okay at her office life, but now she's really happy. Maybe she'll unlock the honeymoon for us. I've been wanting to get the honeymoon thing going for ages. You know what? I think we'll go ahead and let her stay at home with the fam. Because she seems to be having a great time. And it was, it was an office job. It wasn't the best. It wasn't the worst. And she's... Yeah, look at how happy she is. She's just... Oh, okay, we're trying to dodge some of the baby stuff, but... Oh, no! Oh, look, her husband's an artist! So they can have different careers. Oh, that's really exciting. All right, let's try to dodge. Dodge, dodge. All right. Yes! Okay, so she's, she's actually successful with her daughter now. Yeah, and her husband... Wow! Her husband was a famous artist. Look, and I think they live in a new place. Oh my gosh, I finally turned that on too. Wow. Let's see if she can get into a little bit of art towards the end. like Or a little bit of her music towards the end. And maybe her music can influence a grandbaby. We'll try that out. Alright, we'll get a big boost to our health. Because I... Oh no, we outlived the artistic husband! No! Oh my gosh. Alright, well... Now she's got a lot of life that we can just go ahead and patiently wait for. And so she's already like completely in love with her family. Uh oh, we're gonna have to like get a move on here soon. Oh, we missed. Dang it. And I missed out on being able to get a gemstone. That's okay. We'll play with the kid. Yes, baby's having fun. Oh, our bad grandma. <laughs> well, like she tried at a lot of things in life. She didn't quite make it with a few things. However, she almost perfected being a good friend. And she's getting really happy. Oh no, she was getting really happy. <laughs> she had a pretty interesting life, you guys. She's going to tell her grandkids, like, okay, you need to study more in school and take it more seriously than I did as a kid. And then she is probably going to... Uh, Maybe she just really loved music, but just never was able to turn it into a career. That was kind of adorable. And I love how she loved cats. And her husband became a famous artist. I really like how you can pivot and you can become like a, a caretaker of the home, which I think is really wonderful. Yeah, she listened to her friend's problems. She loved the guitar. She was the sweetest to her family. I think that she just really feels like she wasn't very organized early on in life. And it ended up having a big impact on her. So she would encourage, I'm glad my people were around me. I think she would encourage her grandkids to study hard. So maybe we will actually have her grandchild study hard because a long, long, long ago at the very, very beginning, I'm so proud of you growing up all tough. But long ago at the very beginning of this family, we had a lot of teachers. <laughs> so maybe it's time to return to being a teacher or a doctor or something. Yeah, we're going to make her next grandkid just have to focus on, like, I'm going to do my best to study really hard. Who needs friends? Because <laughs> I think sometimes we try really hard to, like, hang out with all of these friends. Oh, I love our kitty. It's possible. I want to see you again. That would be great. <laughs> and at first, maybe she wanted to be a little cop, but, you know, life turned out differently. What? That was so cute. Okay, I'm going to snag this, too. So we can get some more coins. All right, so we only have 16 coins. <sighs> That's not enough to do anything with just yet. Uh, so let's go ahead and we're gonna have our child, who's another girl, go ahead and inherit for generation 14. All right, looks like a normal baby. We haven't had a normal baby in a long time. So we're gonna follow what mom told us is to study hard in school and maybe not get so distracted by friends because she didn't study hard and she really regrets it. So let's try to make like a really studious child who also has a cat because I am not passing up the cat. Ooh, ooh, get it, get it, get it. Okay. All right, we learned ballet. We could have been really 
Okay, there we go. So we were very book smart. We studied really hard. Uh, we'll do whatever this like saxophone weird thing is. Because it's just like the first thing that came up. And then we're going after the books. So basically, if I see books, we're going for them. This is a book. Come on. There we go. There's a book. And then she's trying. Okay, there we go. We're getting more books. Okay, getting more books. We're trying to study really hard. And then help out the teacher. Okay, more friends maybe? Oh my gosh, she's totally gonna be a professor this time. <laughs> yeah, she went to college to become a professor, which I think would make her mom happy. But I don't know if she's very happy herself. Is she gonna be a good, oh no! Okay, we're gonna need a little bit more happiness than this, for sure. Uh-oh. Okay, are we gonna be good? Oh my gosh, we really suck at being a teacher! Hang in there, daughter! She's made a lot of... Okay, cat, make us a little happier, please! <laughs> She's made a lot of money, so we'll go ahead and spend some of that money on trying to attract ourselves a nice husband. And I think she pours herself into her music and she she just did not have any friends in high school. So I think that like so many people were so rude to her in the past. This guy maybe? This guy looks like he'd be into cool music and stuff. Hey, I don't know if we've ever had him as a spouse before. Maybe, maybe not. I think uh, the last few times I recall being denied. All right, maybe they can bond over music together and then maybe their child will inherit music because <laughs> we're having a terribly hard time of having somebody to inherit some music. All right, she sucks as a teacher. So I think we're gonna go ahead and I know we just did the housewife route again, but she just really struggled with being a teacher and I think is super happy to focus on stuff at home instead. All right, try to dodge, try to dodge. Yay! She is super happy. Looks like our husband is a typical office worker. Maybe we should have saved our money from, I mean, we earned a lot of money from the teaching job. Okay, let's see. Oh no, we got in a fight with our teenager. However, our office worker husband, oh, okay, we should have saved that money. If we had saved our money, we could have a better house, but we really tried to go all out. That's okay. A house is still a home. And then we'll go ahead, yes! And she has now put a lot of her life focus into just doing her best. Ah, we're gonna keep moving and see what happens. We'll donate to people who need it. I guess actually it doesn't matter if you, oh, did we win? Yes, we won! All right, we'll play with the grandkid. I hope that, like, does that bring happiness or is it just for fun? Okay, we sucked as grandparents. <laughs> I think it, it extends your longevity, maybe? Hey, and she's actually pretty happy. Let's try to die happy. Yes, okay, I know that sounded really morbid, but I think we just died happy. <laughs> I think we maxed out our happiness. And, you know, she got a few gemstones in her life. Not the life that I thought we were going to have. And I don't know what she would pass on to her kid. Maybe do what makes you happy. So that maybe her child, whatever the baby rolls as, will really push hard to just try to get as many of those tokens. But she studied hard, just it wasn't her passion in the end to become a teacher. Cause she just really sucked at it. So maybe she would have passed on some advice about how to have better chance cards as a teacher, but it just did not work out for her. <laughs> She was great with family and apparently had a good bond with friends, even though we really did not focus on it yet. People said she was cold hearted. I think that's because she didn't have a lot of friend points, but like forget them. They were so mean to her in like school. Why would we care? I wanted to be a fun grandpa or grandma, but I couldn't. Oh, well. There we go. My hundred bucks and that guy's hundred bucks. Are they worth the same? Nope, not really. So I like that. She really just donated the extra money she had. Uh, she tried really hard, but as her daughter or son got older, like it was harder and harder to be able to connect with them. But I think at the end of the day, she just really wants her kid. <laughs> I, tr I didn't do well, but I learned a lot from it. Teaching wasn't as easy as I thought. I think 
all she really wants for her kid is to be able to follow the things that made them happy because she like had no friends really growing up. <laughs> she did love her music too, so maybe her child will end up being influenced to love music as well. We'll have to see. Yay, but there we go, you guys. All right, I'm gonna snag the last little bit we have. And actually, <gasps> that gives us 20. So I wonder, should we go ahead and should we give the professor like penny, 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 cl uh, class success rate increased? Let's see, we could do that for teacher. I think we already turned on another one of the professor increased teacher income, uh, housekeeper to infinity beyond chore success rate increase. Hmm. You know, I think we might go ahead. Um. I think we might go ahead and she was not really into being a teacher in the end. She just really wants her family to be happy. Hmm. So I think we'll inherit the coins to the, ne or the gemstones to the next generation and let them decide what they want to do with it. <gasps> Look at the little music baby. Oh, he's so cute. But all right, guys, thank you so much for joining me on another couple generations of the life family. I really love seeing how they're kind of evolving. I have no idea what the next generation will be, but I think that the, the hope for generation 14 will be that as they are born and as they go out in the world, they will pursue the things that make them happy. That's all their mom really wanted for them. So all right, if you guys could do please leave a like for all the little baboos running around. And if you'd like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, stay curious. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.